everybody, it's time for another Picks of the Week video where I choose five games from the upcoming week in the NHL and tell you who I think is going to win. Last week I went 4-1. and one. I was this close to going 5-0 and oh for the second week in a row, but then Vegas decided to lose to the Arizona Coyotes of all teams and uh, mess that up for me and also blow their winning streak. But that's okay because 4-1 is still a great record. I'm 54-21 and 21 on the season, and we'll be making five more picks this week. Before we get into it, I just ask that you please subscribe and hit that thumbs up if you haven't. It helps the channel an absolute ton and is greatly appreciated. But let's get started here with my picks for this week. As you can see, 54-21 and 21 on the year, and uh, we are getting down towards the end of the regular season here, which means there's only going to be a couple more of these videos. Coming up to start this week, I have a game from tomorrow, which is Monday, May 3rd, the Nashville Predators over the Columbus Blue Jackets. The Nashville Predators have to win this game if they are going to go to the playoffs with Dallas nipping at their heels. They have to make sure that they get the job done against a bottom team like the Blue Jackets. So this game means a whole lot to the Predators and a whole lot of nothing to Columbus, who's already eliminated from the playoffs. Nashville has got to take this one. My next pick comes from Tuesday, the 4th. I have the New York Islanders over the Buffalo Sabres. Now, the New York Islanders just clinched a spot in the playoffs, so... Obviously, they, you know, there's a chance that maybe they take their foot off the gas a little bit or, you know, the game isn't as important. No, it doesn't matter. The Islanders have owned the Sabres this season. Buffalo's been struggling quite a bit over the past couple of weeks. They're not winning a lot of games. Um, and the Islanders are still fighting for seeding in the playoffs. They do not want to drop out of that third spot and down to fourth. And Boston is pushing them for that third spot. So this game still does have some significance. And the Isles have flat out owned the Sabres this season. So I'm taking the Islanders in that one. Uh, the fifth, Wednesday, another game where you know the St. Louis Blues just have to beat the Anaheim Ducks. Now St. Louis may be able to clinch a playoff spot by then. I mean, Arizona is technically still alive, alive as of right now, as of me recording this, but St. Louis could be in a playoff spot by then or could clinch a playoff spot in this game if they get two points. Either way, it doesn't matter. The St. Louis Blues are probably going to the playoffs. The Anaheim Ducks are the worst team in that division. So clearly the St. Louis Blues should win that game. And they've been playing well lately. So seeing how they've been playing lately, I'm going to take the Blues there on Wednesday and uh, take them over Anaheim. Next game is on the 6th, which is Thursday. I have the Pittsburgh Penguins over the Buffalo Sabres. So I'm kind of beating up on the Sabres this week. But again, Pittsburgh is fighting for the division lead in the East. They have to get the job done against a team like Buffalo, who is obviously the bottom team in the league, well out of the playoffs, uh, you know, not even... Not playing for anything right now other than their pride and just to get the get the season over with. So the Penguins should absolutely be able to win that game. I The Penguins haven't dropped a lot of really bad games this season. Like for the most part, they've won the games that they were supposed to. So I'm taking the Pens here and uh, they're going to be fighting hard for first place in the division for sure. Speaking of fighting hard for the first place in the division, well, there's the other team, the Washington Capitals, who I'm picking to beat the Philadelphia Flyers on Friday, May 7th. Washington should beat the Flyers. Again, it's between the Capitals and the Penguins for first place in the East right now. Flyers are a team that's out of the playoffs. Capitals should beat them. And again, if Pittsburgh's going to beat uh, Buffalo on Friday, Thursday, then the Capitals need to beat the Flyers on Friday to keep pace. So I'm going with Washington in that one. And those are my picks for this week in the NHL. On Monday the 3rd, I have the Predators over the Blue Jackets. On Tuesday the 4th, I have the Islanders over the Sabres. On Wednesday the 5th, I have the Blues over the Ducks. On Thursday the 6th, I have the Penguins over the Sabres. Sorry, Buffalo fans. And on Friday the 7th, I have the Capitals over the Flyers. So 
We'll see how the picks do this week. 54 and 21 on the season. 4 and 1 last week. We'll try and go 4 and 1 or 5 and 0 oh again this week and we'll see how it plays out. But those are my picks of the week. Thank you guys for watching. Like, comment, share, subscribe, follow on social media. All those links are down in the description. If you'd like to further support the channel, the links to our Patreon, merchandise store, donation link, and channel memberships in the description as well. Keep spreading the word about this channel. Let's keep this thing growing. Thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll talk to you guys soon.